Well, I did threaten it would be impossible for half naked Daffy again, and here I am, half naked again. As you probably saw from the picture and from the description, I bought from, now I can remember this, to the traditional shaving company. I bought a load of uh, a test of razors to try and find one that suits me. Seven or eight of them. Uh, I'll put a picture at the start. And uh, I'm going to, the first one that I use of each pack, I'm going to do a little review. Don't worry, you don't have to spend 20 minutes watching me shave, because all I'm going to do is just going to talk about what I put in my blade, in my eraser, and then um, have a shave and I'll do the first part, and I'll do it over on sort of really speediness. And then when I've done that, I'll uh, talk through how it feels for the first pass, the second pass, and the third pass. Uh, once I've done that, um, I'll give you my opinion on what the blade was like, uh, whether I enjoyed it or not, or how close it is compared to the other ones. Uh, I'm talking quite quiet, I'm trying to talk quite quiet, I think, because it's uh, quite late at night. Sorry if I keep doing that, but uh, that's a view. Um, so yeah, the first one I've done, uh, as I'll show you the thing, is the Derby. Uh, the reason I have chosen that one is because um, my friend uh, Dean, who uh, I get a lot of advice from, he uh, suggested this one to begin with anyway. And as I said, to begin with, I think he's the one that came in the pack. So, I'm going to use this Darby one. Derby, Darby. And let's uh, see how we go. So, I'll just get this sorted. Oh, that was a lot hotter than usual. And from where we're about from now, I'll be doing it in super speed. So you only have to spend about five minutes watching me learn to shave. Which would be quite amusing. Last time I did it, I did it in uh, two times speed. So I cut it down a little bit. I think I'll do it about three times or four times speed. Just for the hell of it. Already at the first, on the first pass, a completely different feeling. Now I've been told that it's going to feel different on each part, or with it, it's different grades, it's different feelings and uh, I've not found an aggressive blade yet, so I can't tell you what an aggressive blade feels like. Well, that's quite nice compared to the other one. Also feels as if it's done a bit of a better job. I don't know what said the last one this was a manufacturer's own. So it's not surprising. You tend to find the manufacturer ones tend to be slightly better, cheaper quality for some reason. I don't know. Right. I 
will certainly on the cheek areas anyway. It's not very, very good at this. I only had one blade for a while. As soon as the blades started to go blind, I wasn't able to use it. Right, so, opinion. Well, right, I said, the meal one was obviously the manufacturer's one, so it was, um, uh, <laughs> I don't know, what, I don't wanna say the quality is not that good, but it, it cut perfectly well and it did a perfectly good job. Um, <coughs> this was the one that I was suggested, so I was told to use first by Dean. Um, and I wish I had actually started with this one and it's cut quite close and cleanly it's not a, an aggressive blade as far as I can tell um, like I said I've missed a few bits but that's not the blade's fault that's my fault so nice marks on the derby oh cheers for watching and uh, cheerio, and I'll speak to you all later. Ah, I'd like to thank you for watching my videos, and if you've enjoyed what uh, you are watching and would like to continue to support me in my weight loss and uh, encourage me to make more videos, uh, please subscribe to my channel and uh, like the videos that you liked and please also feel free to leave comments uh, i'm also on facebook and i'll put a link to my facebook channel for uh, honey max and the human soup in the description below thank you and uh cheerio